Hello and welcome to the temp tutorial on the Cocos 2DX version 3C++ tutorial series and in this tutorial we're going to look at positioning using the Bezier buy method. This tutorial assumes you've done tutorial 5, if you haven't don't worry there'll be a link in the description to the source code. Also you can just incorporate it into your own project, there will be also another link or links in the description for the source code produced from this tutorial. I said links, I just mean single link. So let's just get down to the coding. So I'm just going to go ahead and open up Xcode from tutorial 5. Once this opens, you want to go to hello world scene.cpp or wherever you want to actually put your code. And what you want to do is do cc bezier config. And we'll just name the bezier. And do bezier dot control point one. So you put the first a curve point. Then we're going to put equals point open bracket zero visible size dot height divide by two. So this is literally the center or it goes up by half in terms of the y axis. Put a semicolon and then we put bezier dot control point two equals point. Now we're going to put 300 minus visible oops, Daisy, visible size dot height divide by two semicolon now we put bezier dot m position so basically where we want it to end we're going to put equals um, point sorry point need to go outside point 200 100 semicolon and this is basically just relative to where it started positioning so you'll be 200 pixels to the right 100 pixels up compared to where it started and if we just literally create an action so auto so there's the auto action equals busier by create first we specify how long we want the action to take I'm just going to put 3 seconds then I'm going to put busier for the action semicolon now we just need to run it so we do my sprite run action bezier semicolon and now we can just zoom out and run the app Ooh. yeah it's working fine it's nope it's not oh we need to specify the action not the bezier config my mistake now if you run it we'll have a sprite that starts at the center just do a nice little curve it's pretty cool you could use this maybe for some sort of Angry Birds game or some sort of, some other sort of slingshot game. Pretty good for trajectory. So you see start at center. Now it's at this end point. So that's it for this tutorial. In the next tutorial we're going to look at Bezier 2. Very similar to the Bezier bike. If you have any questions feel free to message us at support at sonosystem.co.uk. The email will be in the description or just comment or just message us via YouTube or just gain contact however and we will reply. All the required links or source code will be in the description. And as usual thanks for watching and have a nice day.